Piscataway, New Jersey at High Point Solution Stadium, the site for this tremendous college football battle. And now the coin toss, and it's presented by Nissan, innovation that excites. Young, Young deep to return. Nebraska tees up the ball as we get ready for the opening kickoff. Sends it sailing downfield. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Now the offense gets ready to take their first crack at it. Brought down at the 24-yard line. A good tackling safety is key for any defense. And if they can diagnose a play like this guy can, he can be a real menace. It's second down and 11 to go. Ball on the 24-yard line. Mike three. Mike three. Let's go. Three. You know, at that point, I think, Brad, the quarterback's just better off just taking a sack. You have to be very careful as you're feeling pressure to throw the ball just to throw the ball. If you feel like you're not going to be able to make a play and the defense got you, just give up on that play and get ready for the next down. Halfback's got it on a quick throw. And they make the stop around the 33-yard line. Wow, a long game, but still not enough for the first. Well, the offense hurt themselves by digging themselves into a hole on first and second down. So the defense didn't really have to put too much thought in how to defend on that third down. Booming kick. What a collision. Nebraska's offense, a lot of times they can spread things out and they can really be versatile offensively, but when you've got a wide receiver like this, it really helps the cost. But it does, and it, and it continues to help with what they're trying to do. They're trying to find matchups, and when you have one player like this that the defense has got to be aware of, they're going to spread you out, try to find a one-on-one -on -one matchup, and if you spend too much time with this one player, they've got some other weapons to make you pay for it. They go with the option and pick up the first down. Yeah, and that was a situation where the quarterback knew he could pick up the first down if he kept it himself. That's a good decision. He's scrambling. And they bring him down for a sack on the play. The defenders played the snap count perfectly. They found the pass into the backfield and didn't let the quarterback get away. They come up to the line here in second down and 14 after the sack. Mike three. Mike three. And he's tackled at the 48. That's good for a gain of nine yards. That'll bring up third and six. Now he's scrambling. He's at the 40. He's tackled at the 32. That's a game of 16 on the play. First down. Here we go. And he tucked that one in for about five yards. Scramble. And he is drilled at the 23 yard line. Nice run up the middle. And that's their third first down of the drive. The defense needs to figure out a way to stop them, or else they're going to have no problem putting points on the board. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. Game of six yards. That'll make it second and four. We're at play number nine of this current drive. Touchdown, Cornhuskers!
and he adds the extra point. A nine play, 69 yard drive, and that's good for a touchdown. Brad, that's one of those drives that can just tear your heart out. They can really demoralize a defense when they drive the ball down the field, and a lot of the yards came on the ground. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The Cornhuskers are right where they want to be early in this one, partner. Well, this is what their coach talked about, getting off to a great start. The defense did their job, and it's nice to see the offense move the ball down the field and also get some points on the board. And while they are behind, they know they can knot things up in a heartbeat. It's way too early to change your game plan. When you can move the ball downfield in big chunks like that, You've got the defense right where you want it. Tackle made at the 50-yard line. I'll tell you something. I'm loving this quarterback's confidence more and more as this game goes on. He's really throwing the ball with some purpose. Shoved out of bounds at the 35-yard line. That's a team that two two time. Time. That'll move the chance for the Mike Green! Mike Green! Mike Green! Quick strike to the receiver, and he's taken down at the 21-yard line. Inside the 10. Touchdown, Rutgers! That's how you're supposed to run the option. The defense just got lost there. They didn't account for everybody in the backfield, and the rest is history. We'll be tied with the extra point. And he tacks on the extra point. A nice five-play, 75-yard drive, and it results in a touchdown. Brad, I love these kind of drives. They're old school, grind it out and earn the yards and just rip the heart right out of that defense. We're even at seven in this one. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. I don't think either team has a clear advantage so far. Let's see if they can make some plays and get a little separation. Nice run, and he's brought down. Gain of seven yards. First down. They'll bring him down at the 45-yard line. Gain of eight on the play. That makes it second and two. Mills comes away with two yards on the carry. He has some room. Makes it out to about the 43. Call it a gain of 10 yards. First down. some open field. He makes his way out to about the 35. That's good for a gain of eight yards. That makes it second and two. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. Tackle for a loss. Knocked out of bounds at the 25. Gain of 10 yards. That makes it first and 10. Mike Green, Mike Green. And he 
almost has the INT. It can be tough making a play on the ball sometimes, but that's probably a pick he should have made. And this is the 10th play of the drive. Taken down at about the 23-yard line. As a man, he'll lose big yards. Call on the field goal unit here for this long field goal attempt. Nebraska is looking to go up by three. Kicks away. No good. He pushed it to the right. You know, for a second there, I thought it might hook back, but it just kept slicing to the right. That's a tough break. Every drive is important in a tie game. I look for both sides to come out with some urgency. Quarterback all by himself in the backfield with five wideouts. Throws it in a hurry, and he tackles him hard at the 30. That's a game of three on the play. That'll make it second and seven. Offense lines up in a five wide set in a defense, anticipating pass here. Fires out to his wideout. Tackle the 37 yard line. The pass is complete for seven yards, and that'll be a first down. Nice protection, a good pass, and even a better catch. He can ask for much more than that. It was a great read by the quarterback there to take the snap and throw it quickly to get the first. He gets rid of this one. The defense got some pressure and forced a bad pass. I think they've been a little bit more aggressive here with their pass rush, and that time it paid off with an incompletion. Second down, 10 to go. Ball on the 37. And down he goes at the 46-yard line. That'll make it third and one. Gains his way to the 46-yard line. Somebody jumped early down there. All start, start offense. That penalty will move him back a bit. Yeah, and with so many young guys out there, it's bound to happen occasionally. So the penalty makes it first and 15. Oh, it almost picked off. Lewis is intended to see right away. That'll bring up second and 15. The quarterback in the gun, empty backfield, five wide receivers in the formation. Complete, he's got room. Brought down at about the 33 yard line. And they've got all their DBs in there to match up against the five wide set. Catches it and that's all. Washington picks up seven yards with that catch. Caught it, but they're going to lose yards. He would tackle immediately. Loss of two. Really, they just had nowhere to go after the catch. That'll make it 35. So we're looking at another third down here. Tight right, tight right. Three down, three down. Watch 14, watch 14. Gets it out quickly. And they make the stop around the 25 yard line. That'll make it fourth and two. Rutgers could take the lead with this field goal. The kick is away. It's long enough. And it's 
good. And he's got to be happy about that kick. Oh, no question. This kid is just a solid kicker. 10-7, Rutgers. He sends this one deep. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. You never like to have to play from behind, but a deficit this manageable shouldn't be in the front of their minds. They just need to go out there and play. Tackle after a decent run up the gut. That brings us up in the And he's tackled around the 45-yard line. I'm telling you, quarterbacks who can run the ball are so hard to stop. You have to scheme around them, which takes the best coverages out of your defensive playbook. And they'll get him in the backfield. The option is all about timing. And on that play, the timing was just off. That's going to happen sometimes. Second down and 11 yards to the sticks. Ball on the 44. And he just gets rid of it. Flyers quick to an open man. He dropped it. You can't blame him for not hanging on to that pass. He got hit pretty hard. Young, the return man. Brought down at the 26. There are three quarters remaining. The Scarlet Knights with a three-point lead. And we welcome you back to the action here, and we have got a tight one going on in quarter number two. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possession. He makes it out to maybe the 29-yard line. Rutgers has a three-point lead. Complete brought down, nothing doing. Makes the catch and gets out of bounds. Excellent open field tackle. That's good for a gain of 10 yards. That'll make it second and inches. Ready, lighting! He lets it go. Picked off. Number nine with the interception. And that was just an outstanding pick. Great play by the defender to high point the ball, but the quarterback wasn't in rhythm on the throw. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 21-yard line. Quick out to his receiver. He's tackled around the 23-yard line. That makes it second and eight. So gets to around the 42. There's a flag down, and it looks like this one's coming back. Personal style. Clipping. Clipping. Offense. Offense. You got to be careful to avoid Still these. Penalties are a great way to stall out a drive. So it's second down and 15 after the penalty. He makes his way to about the 28. 
That's a D to 12 on the play. Third down. Big opening. He's to the 40. And they push him out at the 38. That's good for a game of 33 yards. That makes it first and 10. Four down, four down. Mike three, Mike three. Gains his way to the 29 yard line. That's a deep nine on the play. That makes it second and two. Here's an opening. Makes it out to about the 20. Gains his way to the 10-yard line. That'll make it second and inches. And he converts the extra point. They line up to kick this one away. Excellent kick. He's to the 20, and he just got drilled. Both teams are kind of struggling to take control of this game. Obviously, they're both very, very competitive with one another. It just seems that the lead is going back and forth between the two teams. The offense will take the field, hoping for a better result than their last drive. And we'll see how aggressive this defense is when they come back out. I wouldn't be surprised if they kept up the pressure to try to fluster this quarterback some more. Makes it to the 34. Lays it out there. Interception. Newsom makes the interception. And the defense just picked up their second interception of the game. This defense has really been in sync during the first half. If they keep this up, it'll be a long day for this offense. It's first and ten. Ball on their own 31. Nebraska is up four. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. That's good for a game of five yards. That brings him second and five. Makes it out to about the 49. That's a game of 15 on the play. That makes it first and 10. Quick throw. He's at the 40. He's knocked out of bounds around the 39 yard line. He's hit and taken down. Call it a gain of 10 yards. That brings up second and nine. And he makes it out to about the 27-yard line. Gain of two on the play. First down. He's gobbled up in the backfield. He wasn't decisive at all on that option. Once he kept it himself, there was no place to go. This is the eighth play of this drive. Good tackle there in space. Gain of 10 yards. That'll make it 30 minutes. Four down, four down. Mike three. Mike three. Has some daylight. Tackle made at the two-yard line. 
That's a game of 16. That makes it first and goal. Nebraska holds a four-point lead. Touchdown, Cornhuskers. That gives him another touchdown to go along with the one he scored earlier. Boy, Brad, this guy's having a huge first half. Already two rushing touchdowns. We know he can throw the football. I love to see his willingness to be able to run with the football, and it puts so much pressure on his defense. And he adds the extra point. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. From his own goal line, he's to the 20. And he just got stood up right there. Here's a step in the maturation of a young quarterback. How does he respond to throwing an interception on that last drive? The game is in danger of getting out of hand early. It's very, very important that they not only hang on to the football this drive, but they also need to get a score on the board as well. That's great execution. Quarterback made a nice throw, and the receiver was able to go up and make the play. They spread the field in the gun with five wide receivers. He makes it to the 42-yard line. That's good for a gain of two yards. That makes it second and eight. Pitch out, got the corner. Nice run to the outside. Gain of seven yards. Third down. Bring him down at the 39. Here's the throw, and I don't think he got anything on that. Williams makes the tackle at the 39 yard line. That brings up second and nine. Catch there before he stepped out of bounds. From the 24 yard line, first down. Nice run there. Swings it out left to the halfback, and he's taken down at the 16-yard line. Number nine makes the tackle at the 16-yard line. That makes it third and three. And they're not going to get it. Great stop. Well, they tried to keep it on the ground for the first down. You know, Brad, here the defense just steps up and makes a play, stopping them and bringing up fourth down. So the field goal unit is on the field. They'll try for three points. He gets it up, and the field goal is good. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. And he got all of this one. Great kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The Cornhuskers offensive staff, I think, has done a good job of keeping their wide receiver in the game. Even though he's not having great stats, he's part of it, and the rest of the team now is picking up his slack, I think. Well, this offense is still putting points on the board, and I think at times they're actually using the wide receiver, the go-to man who's drawing so much attention, really as a decoy, open up other avenues of this offense. I've seen other receivers make some plays. They're running the football. So it'll be interesting to see what kind of adjustments this defense makes to try to slow down these other members of this offense. And who knows, maybe that could open it back up to that marquee receiver. Completes it, but he can't shake the defense. Nebraska is up by eight.
complete big loss. So the offense fails to pick up a first down. Very nicely done here by the defense. They did a good job of keeping them in check on their side of the field. Young is back deep to return the punt. Young fields it at the 34. Tackle at the 44-yard line. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. He gets rid of this one. The defense got some pressure and forced a bad pass. I think they've been a little bit more aggressive here with their pass rush, and that time it paid off with an incompletion. Second and 10, ball on the 44-yard line. And they're going to put six DBs on the field to counter that five-receiver look. Catches it, and he's looking for more. Tackle at the 47. The Scarlet Knights call a timeout. That's their second of the half. Makes it to the 37. Can't get away from the pressure. That'll make it second and long. He's got it with room to run. And down he goes at the 32 yard line. He airs it out. Oh my, what a catch, touchdown! Wow, an almost impossible pass to defend, and it goes for six. Yep, the defense would have needed 12 guys on the field that time. And the quarterback stays on the field as they try for the two-point conversion. Rutgers gets set to kick this one away. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. This is the point in the game where you don't want to make any mistakes that give the other guys a reason to feel more confident going into halftime. And they make the stop at the 37. Did you see how much space there was for that tailback up front? He better be thanking his offensive lineman for that. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 37. Going deep. Doesn't get there. We played a half of football. We've got a stalemate right now, 21 apiece. Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. It's Davis, David Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. Both of these offenses have been extraordinary running the football in the first half. One of the marks of a great running back, the yards he gets after contact. One of the marks of a great offensive line, the yards the running back gets before contact. And there were plenty of both in the first half. Uh, when you're an offensive line, you're on offensive line because you're not talented enough to play defensive line. That's a fact. So what do they want to do? Well, they say they're smarter, though. They are smarter, believe me. <laughs> but what do they want to do? They want to get their hands on you as fast as possible. They love run blocking. It's much better than dropping back backwards, kick stepping, and try to catch a fast guy around the corner. They want to make their big mitts on you. They want to make it ugly. They want to grind the game out. And that's what they've been able to do. Everything they've done in the run game has worked so far. And the defense needs to get some stops. And they rush the passer, man. It's a lot more fun than playing the run the whole time. David and I will stay locked in on everything going on in college football. We're going to wrap it up here in the studio. Just about time to get you out to your second half. Brad and Kirk ready with a call.
All right, Reese and David, thanks, guys. Second half action just about ready to start here. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. A lot of times you'll see teams start to clench up a little bit when games stay close well into the second half. You need to stay loose, keep doing what you've been doing all week in practice, and execute when it's time. Brought down to the 33-yard line. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. Call it a gain of seven yards. First down. Got some open field. Martinez carries the ball. Gain of 13 yards. First down. Big opening. He's taken down at about the 35. Game of 12 on the play. That makes it first and 10. Mike three, Mike three. Bumble, bumble, bumble. Let's go. Block two, block two. And they get nice yardage on that run. Game of five yards. That'll make it second and four. He's tackled at the 28. Third down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. Mike three. Mike three. Ready. Makes it out to about the 19. First down. He's on the run. The five. Touchdown, Nebraska. He's having quite a game. Three rushing touchdowns now. I know this defense prepared for his running ability, but even so, boy, he's had a great day. He splits the uprights with the extra point. Looks like they're ready for the kick. He's to the 20. And down he goes at the 31-yard line. This deficit can be easily overcome, sure. But they have to be thinking if they don't get something going on this series, the burden is going to be felt by their defense. He's tackled at about the 33 yard line. That makes it second and eight. Get to that quickly. Breaks one. Tackle made around the 48 yard line. Throw. He's at the 40. And he shoved out of bounds around the 34 yard line. He has some room. He's at the 20. Touchdown saving tackle, but it leaves him with a first and goal. And now the ball is free. And the quarterback comes in and scoops up the fumble. The five. And he scores. Touchdown. 
Defensive touchdowns give teams such a big morale lift. This was a really nice play to grab the loose ball and take it the distance. He makes the PAT. Nebraska lines up for the kickoff. He really got a hold of that kick. He's to the 20. And he's tackled at the 26. Well, let's see if the offense can make up for the misfortune they had just a few moments ago. I know as a quarterback, it's always hard to watch the defense score a touchdown on you. But it was always a reminder to take extra care of the football. Boss is out to the tailback on the screen. They'll bring him down at the 36. on the screen and he's level at the 47 yard line nice play across the middle and he's taken down around the 30 yard line Gets out to about the 21-yard line. That's a good game. That brings in second and nine. Mike's 42. Mike's 42. Quick pass, and he's right there to knock it away. Brad, this corner just made a great play on the football. You wonder if he's starting to maybe get into the mindset of this quarterback, and maybe the quarterback's going to look in the other direction to try to come up with a completion. Makes it out to about the seven. He got the ball and he was off like a shot. This guy has some big time speed. Another trip in the red zone here for the offense. They don't want to give it up like they did last time. That's a great tackle at the nine. That's a loss of two yards. Up. That brings up second and goal. From the nine yard line. It's second down. Empty backfield. Quarterback in the gun. Five wide receivers. He fights forward to about the seven. Call it a game of two yards. That makes it 30 goal. They come out in a five wide set. Looks to the end zone. Interception. This shows some great preparation by the defensive staff. It seems like he can't throw a pass without a defender knowing where it's headed. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 20-yard line. He gets to about the 34-yard line. First down. He's at midfield. He's knocked out of bounds. Right around the 48-yard line. First down. Go down, go down. Watch, watch number 86. Watch 86. Zero, zero, Mike Green. Go. Run in, Weasel. Run, 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 run. The offensive line got a really good push there, allowing the back to pick up nine on the play. That brings in second and one. Makes it out to about the 30. Gain of nine yards. Man left, man left. That makes it first and 10. Mike three, Mike three. Fumble, fumble, fumble. Let's go. Easy, easy, easy. Fuck two, fuck two. Put hot, hot. On the pitch, look out, loose ball. Scoops it up. There he goes. He's at the 20 for the 10. Touchdown. 
Rutgers is ready to kick it away. He just drills this one. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. It was a rough road on their last drive as the fumble led to a touchdown. You know, after that last turnover by this offense, the momentum has really turned in this game. And right now, you've got to believe this defense is going to come out and play with a lot of intensity and a lot of aggression. That's a game seven on the play. That'll bring up second and three. Nebraska is up seven. And he hits him hard at the 40. That's, That's good, good for a gain of eight yards. yards. First, First down. down. Two down, three down. 17 is blank, Mike 17. Check three, check three. Check three, check three. Tackled Two after decent down. pickup. Call a gain of six yards. That'll, That'll make, make it second, second and four. four. Let's go. They bring him down in the backfield. The option is all about timing, and on that play, the timing was just off. That's going to happen sometimes. Third down now, and they need to get it out to midfield. He goes out of bounds at the 48-yard line. Young is back deep to return. From the 15, he makes it to the 28-yard line. There's still plenty of time to keep running their offense as usual here. I don't think they need to feel any anxiety about trailing. Steps out of bounds at about the 31. That'll make it second and seven. Two down, two down. Two, eight, two, eight. fight. Here we go. Three, nine. Two hundred. He makes it out to maybe the 33-yard line. That's good for a two yards. That'll make it third and five. Sets up a screen. Tailback's got it. Tackle right around the 40. Throws it in a hurry. He's pushed out of bounds at the 40-yard line. No gain. That makes it second and 10. Gets hit out of bounds at the 44 yard line. Quick pass going back to his running back. And down he goes at the 43 yard line. First and 10. Ball on the 43 yard line. the stop right around the 34. That'll make it 31. Here we go. Pitches it. He's got the corner. He's got an opening. And they push him out at the 24. Second 
Let's see if they can put that last interception behind them and do something different this time in the red zone. And he's tackled right away. And he makes it out to about the five-yard line. That brings up a second and goal. Ball on the five. Mike 42, Mike 42. Here we go. Touchdown, Scarlet Knights. It shouldn't have surprised these guys to see the run coming in, but they just couldn't stop it. Here's the PAT to tie this thing up. And he converts the extra point. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. And he got all of this one. Great kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The Scarlet Knights defense really looked pathetic in that first half, Kirk, and now they're doing a nice job. Well, obviously, they've made some adjustments after the first half, and it's paid off for them. I think right now they're tuned in to what this offense is trying to do, and I think they're also just playing with a little bit more of a chip on their shoulder. Now's when you start to approach each drive, thinking that if you take the lead, then the momentum you gain feels that much more powerful. That's a three. And so we've reached the end of quarter number three here with one quarter to go. We're all tied up. Into the fourth quarter now, and we're back to the action. Under pressure, brought down at the 22. Throw to the back, it's incomplete. There was not a soul open there. He threw into double coverage because it was an obvious passing down. The defense knew the pass was coming. Doesn't look like he's going to have much time to get rid of this punt. Young fields it at the 39. He makes it out to maybe the 49 yard line. And you know, it's basically like we're starting from zero here in a one-quarter game now. Every possession is vital. And he's tackled after positive yardage. From the 38-yard line, it's second down. Runs it right. Nice pickup. move he throws complete Lewis gains about a yard with a short completion that brings us so the kicker comes out he'll try to put three points on the board it's up looks long enough and he nails the long field goal Right. 
Rutgers ready to kick this one off. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. Well, I'm sure the return man would have loved to go for six that time. They have time on the clock, so I wouldn't rush things here. The important thing is to move the ball down the field and put points on the board. This is a pretty crucial series right here. With things being so tight, your best players have to step it up on both sides of the ball. And he's tackled at the 34. They go with a run, and that'll be a gain of nine. That brings in second and one. Gets to about the 34-yard line. A yard, if that, on the quarterback keeper. He fights forward to about the 36. Gain of two yards. Man left, man left. First down. Gets out to about the 38-yard line. That makes it second and eight. Check three, check three. He's tackled at the 46. Young makes the tackle at the 46-yard line. That'll bring up third and inches. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. That's a gain of five on one play. That makes it first down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 49 yard line. Watch two, watch two. Mike three. Mike three. Pitch out, got the corner. Tackle made at about the 39 yard line. That'll make it second and inches. Makes it out to about the 29. Gain of 10 yards. First down. Three down, three down. Mike three, Mike three. Easy, easy, easy. Fires quick out to the receiver, and he can't make the grab. I like the scheme the defensive coordinator came up with here. They were all over the place on that play and left the quarterback nowhere to throw it. Mike three. It's second and 10. Ball on the 29. He steps out at about the 25-yard line. That's a gain of four on one way. That'll bring up third and six. They'll bring him down at about the 23-yard line. Well, he caught it, but it's almost no yards gain, and now it's fourth down. Give props to the D here for coming up with a big stop on third down. It's fourth down. They'll call on the field goal unit here. The kick is up. He clanks it off the upright. No good. And they missed the chance to tie this thing up. You know, that kicker feels really bad right now, but wait till the right tackle gets a hold of him and pounds him into the ground. You know this is a real crucial time in the game. It could still go either way. Rutgers is up by three. He's out of bounds around the 27-yard line. That makes it second and six. Quick throw, and he's taken down at the 31. That'll bring up 32. Check, 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 three, check, three. And they get nice yardage on that run. For third down and medium, you'd think the defense would have a chance here to get really aggressive and to be able to stop the offense. I don't know, maybe they were anticipating a pass there, but they've got to do a better job of defending the run, especially on third down. Out of bounds, around the 40 yard line. the 
43. Robinson, the return man. And this one is a beauty. This one will go into the end zone, and they'll bring it out to the 20. The kicker missed a field goal on the last drive, so the offense is out here trying to turn it around on this one. Yep. It was a rough go-around for this kick for the last time. But this guy won't hang his head. If he has another opportunity to kick one, he'll be ready to go. Nice run up the middle. That's good for the game of seven yards. That'll bring up second and three. Just over two minutes in the game. Big opening. Tries to get around the corner. And he's tackled no at the 46. No That's a game of 27 on the play. That, that makes, makes it first, first and 10. 10. Back to him, and he gets nothing this time around. From the 47-yard line, it's second down. Needed that play, and he dropped it. Over the middle to his tailback. Tackle at about the 43 yard line. That brings us fourth and seven. He's going to try and scramble. Sacked, and they'll turn it over. I think they had to go for it given the circumstances. They just couldn't pull it off. Both teams realize that when the ball is snapped, we're one play away from a very different ball game. Has some daylight. Makes it to the 41. Right, that's a huge first down for this offense. At this point, the defense's only hope is they've got to try to rip that ball away from the quarterback or the running back to get the football back to their offense because the clock now is a big factor. Up the middle for a nice game. Nebraska will have one timeout remaining. Second and five coming up here. Ball on the 36. A little over a minute in the game. Got some open field. Runs outside for a nice game. Nebraska's out of timeout. He makes it out maybe to the 26-yard line. That makes it second and six. It's second down, six yards to go. Ball on the 26. He gets out to about the 17-yard line. This should be a kneel down as they just try to kill the clock. The 
The Cornhuskers, I'm sure, are secure in the knowledge that despite this setback today, they still have one of the best players in the country. Well, this is a devastating loss, but it's one that they're going to have to put behind them. And as you said, they still have one of the best players in the country. They don't need to deviate their plan, get back to really what they know, and that's getting the ball to their star player. And next week, I'm sure they'll be fine. That's going to do it for this presentation of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Herbstreit, this is Brad Nessler saying goodbye.